over again. Throughout the 110 years of our alma mater's presence in the Philippines, Assumption has produced spirited and influential women, not only in the fields of politics, business, medicine, and the arts, but more importantly, in the extraordinary, challenging, and rewarding environment of the home, raising Christian families and future leaders of our country. Today, we celebrate these women in as much as we honor the incomparable educational institution that has nurtured and defined us all. I am a wife, a mother, and I work towards poverty reduction in our country. And I was educated at the Assumption. I'm an entrepreneur and I was educated at the Assumption. I'm a dentist. I was educated at the Assumption. I'm a lawyer, a public servant, and I was educated at the Assumption. I'm an executive of a telecommunications company, and I was educated at the Assumption. Wife, mother, and volunteer, and I was educated at the Assumption. I'm a headhunter, and I was educated at the Assumption. I'm a financial advisor, and I was educated at the Assumption. I'm a designer and a teacher. I'm a film and television actress. I'm a certified public accountant. I'm now a housewife. I'm an event stylist. I'm a trader. I'm a football mom. I love to innovate. I'm a homemaker. I'm an SAP solution architect. I lead a Bible study group. I have collections and recoveries for a multinational bank. I raise three wonderful children. I'm a theater performer, an early years educator, and a mother. I'm a scientist in the field of agricultural biotechnology and food security. I am a mother, a wife, a daughter, a sister, and a friend. I'm looking forward to calling myself a breast cancer survivor very soon. by the sisters and our teachers. From you, our teachers, we learn the foundations of knowledge, and more importantly, those lessons that are now deeply ingrained in us, values that we now pass on to our children, our workmates, and the nation. So tonight, we choose to honor you, our beloved Assumption sisters, and our teachers. For you embody what it means to love and to serve no matter the cost. It could not have been easy teaching a bunch of rambunctious adolescents at a time of turmoil for our country, but you persevered. Better, you made us who we are today. So, because of all of you, we have been changed for good. Something new to learn, and we are led. 